Hey guys, welcome. In this video, we are going to talk about some concepts regarding partnerships, business partnership. And this topic actually comes under ratio and proportion as well as profit and loss. We will also be looking at some formulas related to partnerships. So let us assume that we have a business. Usually a business has partners. So let us assume that there are two partners. This is partner A and this is partner B. And partners invest money in business. So assuming that partner A invest X rupees and partner B invests Y rupees. And these people invest these much of rupees for the same time period. Let us say that these people invest this amount X and Y for one year. Right. So the ratio of the profit earned by A and the profit earned by B is proportional to the ratio of the money they invested in. In other words, if I write it, I can write it as the ratio of A's profit to B's profit is equal to the ratio is equal to the ratio of the money they invested. And this what we wrote is nothing but the proportion. The proportion is such that the ratio of profits of A and B is in proportion with the ratio of the money they invested in. If the investments are for different time periods, let us say that A invests X rupees for P months and B invests rupees Y for Q months. Then the ratio of the profit of A to the profit of B becomes the compounded ratio of the months and the amount they invested in. So I can write the compounded ratio of X and Y and P and Q. So these are the basic formulas related to partnership. Let us solve a problem now. So the question is A and B started a business by investing 5000 and 3000 rupees respectively. A invest for 6 months and B invests for 10 months. What is the ratio of profits of A and B? Let's gather the data now. We have A who invest 5000 rupees, right? And these 5000 rupees are invested for 6 months. Coming to B, he invests 3000 rupees. And for a period of 10 months. So according to our terminology, this is X, this is Y, the amount invested by A and B. And this is P and this is Q. Now we want the ratio of profits of A and B. And we know the formulas. A's profit by B's profit as equal to X is 5000, P is 6 months, divided by Y is 3000 times Q is 10. So cancelling out all the zeros, we have 5 times 6 by 3 times 10. So 5 times 2 is 10 and 2 times 3 is 6 and this 3 and this 3 get cancelled out. So we have 1 by 1. So the ratio is 1 is to 1. That means that A and B earn the same amount of profit.